What's up everybody? Welcome back to Charleston Car Videos. Stay with us. All right, everybody, welcome to today's new video at the Auto Buy Center. My name is Chad. I'm here today to show you this beautiful Buick Bonneville. Did I say Buick? Hold on, let me make sure. I think the Bonneville is actually made by Pontiac. But anyways, we got our little sheet right here today. We're gonna talk about this car, let you see it on today's video and do something a little different. So let me know what you think about this whole setup here on Charleston Car Videos tonight while we are reviewing cars. Let me know if you like this whole setup. I think I'm trying something a little different and we're gonna have a little fun. So stay with us. The Buick Bonneville. No, it is not a Buick. I know some of y'all probably gonna slap me upside the head through the computer screen, but actually Pontiac makes the Bonneville. This Bonneville here today Today is a 2005, okay? It's got the 3.8 liter V6 with 203,000 miles. That's right, 200 plus thousand miles. Somebody has wore this baby right on out. But let me tell you, there's plenty of wearing and tearing to be done on this car for many more years to come. Now here's the thing, folks, we already got the price up on the window. It's $1,500. No, that is not $1,500 down. That is $1,500 cash money put it on the damn table let's make a deal happen today so 1500 bucks now the only other fees involved with buying a car here at the auto buy center in beautiful Ravenel South Carolina is you're gonna have 5% sales tax plus a $150 dealer admin dealer processing dealer uh, fee as some dealerships say but that that fee for $150 on a sedan is gonna cover your DMV stuff your registration titles all that stuff our lady here at the store will handle all that for you and then we'll let you know when the tags come in so again folks if you are interested in watching this quick clip of the buick vonneville please pontiac bonneville please let me know i'm trying to do the best i can to speed some of these videos up for y'all so you don't have to watch an eight minute walk around video on an old 1500 used car but you can see it as you just got done seeing it right here on the video today stay with us next car coming up on the screen today will be something i don't know what it is yet but it'll be something special for you i'm chad make sure you like comment and subscribe and let me know the feedback on our first time doing a video like this All right, guys, thanks for watching with us again. You know, as usual, I'll never leave you stranded where you don't get to see me actually drive the car a little bit. So if you're still watching, thank you for that. Let's go ahead and put the vehicle in drive and uh, let's turn the radio down. The radio does work, which is great, but let's just drive the car right through the parking lot, see how it is. Um, again, it's got 200,000 miles. Suspension feels pretty good on the car. A lot of room on the inside. The leather interior is actually in great shape. A lot better shape than some cars out here with leather, so um, that's a good thing. The headliner definitely is falling down up top right here, okay? It looks like a girl's skirt flying in the wind on a Saturday or Sunday morning. Ooh, I tell you, isn't that nice? But anyways, you know, the Buick, the Pontiac. <laughs> you know, Pontiac and Buick, they're probably about the same damn company, really, at the end of the day. But again, not a bad car for $1,500. If you need cheap and inexpensive transportation, this may be, uh, may be an option for you, okay? So again, pretty clean car for the money. Um, it does have a uh, service engine soon light on right up here, okay? Just want to point that out to you. Service engine soon, airbag lights on, anti-lock brake light on, the brake light is on. And it does got check gauges and all that, 203, 553 mileage. Um, let's check and see what's going on with the, uh, the, the system in here. Let's cut this on and see if it'll blow for us. That was one little situation I was having with the car earlier is it wasn't seeming to, uh, the fans weren't blowing. Let's give this a try. So technically right now the fans aren't cutting on to blow air out so i cannot tell you if the heat or the ac work as always folks try to be as upfront and transparent as possible on our videos and on the vehicles that i sell if you are watching or contacting me off of facebook messenger or something like that please ask for me when you come to the dealership there is a few salespeople that work here and they're not always going to make sure that you are dealing with me through the internet okay when you come in please again ask for chad uh, you know what I look like, and again, I'll do anything I can to make sure you get a great deal on a car and know exactly what's going on with the vehicle when you buy it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you soon.